Good afternoon, boys and girls. Today, I'm going to read to you a very special children's book. Um, the reason this children's book is so special to me is because I am the author. That means I wrote this children's book. Um, this children's book is about two little girls who spend the summer with their Nana and the many adventures that they go on. Without further ado, The Adventures of Pooh and Munchkin Doodle, written by Sabrina Gay and illustrated by Avon Manning. Every night before bed, Daddy would read Pooh a story and together they would say their prayers. Pooh loved her daddy and she loved when he read to her. As Daddy kissed Pooh goodnight, he whispered in her ear, I love you, Daddy's big girl. Throughout the night, Pooh remembered what her daddy said. She was a big girl, she was two. She knew five of her colors, could count to ten, and each day she learned more of her letters. She knew that in a few hours her baby cousin, Munchkin Doodle, would be there, and she would help her Nana take care of her. Waking up the next morning, Pooh heard a baby crying. Pooh knew it was her baby cousin, Munchkin Doodle. Pooh followed the crying sounds into the living room where she found Munchkin Doodle and her Nana. It's okay, Pooh told her cousin. As if Munchkin Doodle understood, she smiled. Nana told Pooh that Munchkin Doodle was crying because she was hungry and that it was time to eat. Pooh wanted to show Nana that she was a big girl, bigger than two, so she fed Munchkin Doodle her bottle. Just as Munchkin Doodle finished her breakfast, she fell asleep in Pooh's arms. Nana, Nana, the baby is asleep, Pooh yelled. Smiling, Nana took Munchkin Doodle and put her in the bed. Then she kissed Pooh and told her, I'm so proud of you, Nana's big girl. Grinning from ear to ear, Pooh followed Nana into the kitchen for her breakfast. Now that Munchkin Doodle had her breakfast, it was time for her to have hers. She had her own big girl table and it was covered with her favorite stickers. Today, she was a big girl, bigger than two. Nana fixed her favorite breakfast. Blueberry pancakes, sliced bananas, and chocolate milk. Pooh finished all of her breakfast and Nana let her watch TV. While she watched her favorite cartoon, she colored in her big girl coloring book. She even colored a pretty picture for Munchkin Doodle. Just as Pooh finished coloring her picture, Munchkin Doodle began to cry. Tapping Nana, Pooh said, the baby is crying, the baby is crying. When Nana and Pooh went into the bedroom to get Munchkin Doodle, Pooh gave Munchkin Doodle her favorite stuffed monkey to play with. She giggled and smiled. Pooh noticed that when Munchkin Doodle smiled, she only had one too. Nana, Nana, why does Munchkin Doodle only have one too, she asked. Nana replied, because she is a baby, a little baby, and as soon as she becomes a big girl like you, she will have more teeth. Just watch. You will see. So that's what Pooh did. She watched every day. When Munchkin Doodle crawled around the living room, Pooh watched. When Munchkin Doodle ate her food, Pooh watched. When Munchkin Doodle played, Pooh watched. And when Munchkin Doodle watched TV, what do you guys think Pooh did? Absolutely. She watched. Then one day, Pooh noticed something. Could it be that Munchkin Doodle was growing a new tooth? Yes, indeed. Munchkin Doodle was officially growing a new tooth, and according to Pooh, that made two. One, two, she counted, showing her fingers to Nana. But even with her new tooth, she was still a baby. And Pooh made sure to tell Nana as Munchkin Doodle crawled into her lap and started making baby sounds. Before long, Pooh and Munchkin Doodle were fast asleep from a full summer of playing, eating, watching TV, and counting teeth. Just as Nana covered up both girls, the doorbell rang. Ding dong! 
Opening the door, Munchkin Doodle's mom smiled as she saw Pooh and Munchkin Doodle fast asleep in their beds. After kissing and hugging both girls, she thanked Nana. Once Munchkin Doodle was all packed up and ready to go home, Nana herself rested right beside Pooh. Nana knew that once Pooh woke up, the adventures would begin again. The end. I hope you guys like this book, um, The Adventures of Pooh and Munchkin Doodle. So stay tuned for more adventures. Have a great day and a great learning experience.